Well, we're developing in Manhattan over the rail yards, which has probably been one of the most abandoned spa spaces yeah. probably in New mm -hmm. York, you know. And, and we are here we are, it, it, we're, we're developing the largest project ever in the United States. So we had to make a statement and, uh, and to do something that was going to be the new great work, live, work, play environment, really creating the great next neighborhood in New York, which to most places would be a brand new city. Uh, and the scope of it is so big. So it really required something that was kind of out of the box thinking. And if some... our viewers aren't driving a car right now, they can see it on the screen. What is Describe it? Describe this. What is this? Looks like an up -down, upside down beehive almost. It, 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 I think that's a good way to describe it. It's 150 feet high and it's 150 feet in diameter at the top. So it's very large in scope and it's open. Uh, it has an elevator in it uh, and people, it's a bunch of stairways with landings that you can walk around the entire, uh, what we call vessel. And it's over a mile uh, in distance if you walked around it to the top. Right. You're taking suggestions for names because the vessel is just a, a temporary yes. name for it. Yeah, we're going to let the public really how they experience and wait and kind of name it themselves. I think you know, much like in Chicago and Millennium Park, how they named uh, the Anish Kapoor parcel. We'll open it in the fall of uh, 18. All of 18. Yes. Are you? Go ahead, finish your thought. I mean, that, at, at, that, at that point, the retail and the plaza will be entirely done, and several of the buildings will be open. We already have one of the buildings already open now uh, at the space. We have 10 and a half million square feet under construction. So, are, huge. are you nervous yeah. at all about the timing of this project and when it's going to come online? There's so much supply coming in to New York City, particularly mm -hmm. on 57th Street, which is farther north. Sure. Barry Sternlich yesterday in real estate mm -hmm. delivering alpha said he thought New York was softening. So much supply coming online. Are you worried about that? I mean, you're always concerned. You know, you don't take anything for granted. But I think what we're developing is so unique and, it, and there's a great demand for it. And I think it's the best quality product that will be offered to the marketplace. Uh, we have already leased 7 million square feet of office space. The building that's open right now, a million 750,000 square feet, is 100% leased. We have the second building of 2 million 7 that's 100% uh, will be occupied, uh, spoken for. We have another building that's, over, that's a million three that's uh, over 50%.